Long ago, the land of Vesuvia was created under the founder, Ace Alun, son of the moon god Vesu. The land was very rich in resources. It had mounds full of gold, mountains of riches. Until one day, a man named Hans Havusa, son of the sun, waged war on Mysteria. Almost everybody was wiped out, including Ace. But only one man had survived. Zern, Ace's son. He travelled to the highest mountain to talk to his grandfather. Eventually, he found the great mound on which the giant wolf rested. Vesu's physical form, the wolf, said, Speak, I try. Father, I need your help to defeat the tyrant that destroyed our people. Very well. You may use the strength of the wolf. Zern travelled back to Hans's capital city with his new founded army. Expected Zern had won the war. But at what cost? To save a dying nation? With his last breaths, he told his son, My son, you will lead this dying nation to victory. Make Vesu proud. He took the golden crown off his head and placed it in his son's hand. You are a very honorable man, father, but I can do better. I awaken from my slumber in the castle, and I have one goal set in my mind today. Rebuild a tree. Ever since the war with Hans, everyone in Vesteria has been miserable. The only place that has survived over time was the Grand Castle, which wasn't even looking that grand. So, I decided to build up the fortifications of a tree, the capital city. As I was building, I noticed someone. I had a visitor. Someone who wanted to live in Acer Tree. That's right, it was Grim. Grim wanted to live with me in Acer Tree. Now, there were many immediate thoughts that came to my head when Grim told me that he wanted to join Acer Tree. Number one, I was going to have a coronation soon as my father would retire. So I was going to invite the entire server, including Pitch, who was literally hunting down Grim. I wonder how that go down. A fight in my castle. God, if that ever happened, I don't know what I'd do. But I put all of those thoughts to the side and I decided to continue building. Gathering materials, I found a wolf. The prime symbol of Vesu, our god. This means a lot for us. This means I'm going in the right direction. My lord, my king, our savior. You see how devoted I was to my faith by that. That encounter, I decided I would build a temple for Vesu later. For now, my building, the town, had to be put on focus. It could not be put on hold. It continued as normal. Good progress was being made until this happened. I went into the nether. I wandered around the nether for a while till I realized this is very boring. So I decided I was going to go home. So I went back into the pool. But something very unexpected was about to happen. <coughs> what the hell? <laughs> um. Where am I? I don't know. I might as well explore this place. Dude, this is big. That's right. I had discovered XD Pit's base. This would be very helpful for future wars. But 
I couldn't be like that. I couldn't snoop around and steal stuff. So I decided to go back until I realized I can't. If I just go back into the portal, it will just keep on teleporting me here. So I was trapped here forever until this happened again. I was super clueless. I was very, very clueless to be added. All of this journey had made my progress and my curiosity very high. It made my curiosity very high. So progress was put on the low. I really needed to work. The people on the stereo were begging me to help. I was too distracted. I couldn't. I literally couldn't. I failed my people already. I'm not even being coronated yet. The only thing I've done is probably build one house. The smelters are the miners. And that's it. A failure. Until I realize something. What am I doing? I'm delusional. I don't have family. I don't have a father. I don't have a sister. I don't have a mother. They all died long ago. I realized one thing. I'm the prince of Vesuvia. Realization hit me. I would be the best monarch that ruled over this putrid country in a while. I will not make it putrid. I'll make it better and the strongest. Those who dare to oppose me will die by the wrath of the empire. The sun will never set on the Vesuvian Empire.